All right, hello everyone on YouTube, Main Man Sui here, hoping everyone is doing great as always. And I was just sitting down with Wilhelm, I fed him breakfast and I put all of his clothes on his little body and we're, we're gonna head out. And then suddenly it's like, oh god, the, I get the information that the patch notes have dropped and I'm like, oh for fuck's sake. It's gonna be my day off, you know. I do work a lot, but my work is a lot of fun, I love it, but... I was just going to head out, and then the fucking Leroy patch notes drop, and it's just, the timing is always the best. So, uh, w without further ado, these are the 3.21 patch notes. The update, from what I hear, is already live on PS4, it's not live on PC, but this is the official emergency anti-Leroy patch from the developers of Tekken. So, I haven't had it spoiled, we're going to get into it now. The first move is 1-1, one, 1-2-1. One, one one. So this is the infamous, super broken, 10-hit counter-hit string that is hit confirmable. And as you can see, we already here have many lines of text on both the second hit, the sixth hit, and the seventh hit. Uh, so on the second hit, change the frame advantage when guarded from minus seven, to minus nine. So that's for one one that really good players with fast reflexes can hit confirm from. It's so now live on PC. It's it's still not oh, it's live on PC. Thank you very much. Uh, good information. So now um, I mean he already kind <laughs> he already lost his turn in minus seven. It's still safe at minus nine, but that's as bad as it gets without being punishable. Change the frame advantage upon a hit from plus four frames to plus two. It's still good uh, with, with, with a plus two, but absolutely better. Homing decreased. <laughs> Why that ever had tracking is, you know. Okay, sixth hit. So that's the last of the machine gun punches. Uh, change the frame advantage, advantage when guarded from minus 10 to minus 13. Change the frame advantage upon hit from plus one to minus two. And seventh hit, change the frame damage. Uh, oh, sorry, change the frame damage. Change the damage from 20 to 15. Okay, uh, so it's, ha it's, it's had a damage nerf. It does five damage less. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but this does 47 damage, right? Pr prior to this patch, and so now, now it does 42. It's still a shitload of damage, uh, and it has worse frames, absolutely. Um, uh, I don't know, it still remains really, really good. Um, but well, maybe it's not, it's not super broken anymore, but it, it's... I, I guess I, I have to test it in actual gameplay, but it, it's, it still seems to be really good. Uh, and now we have the 14 frame punish, 1 plus 2, 1 plus 2, 1, change the damage from 32 to 27. Oh, they mean the, the last hit. Yeah, the last hit used to do 32, now it does 27. And that used to do a total of 56 damage? Am I correct? So now it does 51? So it's still hits like a truck, basically. Uh, but you know what, those can stay if they do some changes to the crazy, I mean the, the absolutely batshit crazy in my opinion attacks, like down, these are crazy, but down 1 plus 2 and back 1 plus 2 are just too much. In my opinion he can have those cool 10 frame, that cool 10 frame string, a cool 14 frame punish, uh, but yeah let's just proceed. Down 2, 4, decrease the distance between the character and the opponent when the move is guarded. Right. Uh, it used to, that 4, when you um, crouched and blocked it, it, it had such pushback on block that Kazuya's twin pistons would whiff. So now they, they, they've decreased the pushback, so that minus 13 will now work as intended, that a lot of uh, characters with 13 frame launches will launch it. Uh, so that's good. Um, down 3, change the damage from 14 to 10. Oh, significant. Down 3-2 is one of his key moves, to, um, key lows to start offense and just, you know, harass the opponent or just start offense, basically. 
so that has does four damage less. That's good, but I guess down three two is still natural combo. Okay, this is a huge one. Down one plus two, uh, probably the best move in the game. Could be. Change the opponent's behavior when guarded. Frame advantage will become neutral frames to minus four frames when guarded. Oh, it's minus four now on block. Again, why was it ever neutral on block? This is really good. Uh, but mi minus four, that, that's still good. Uh, change opponent's behavior when counter hit. <laughs> okay, it's, it's not a counter hit launcher anymore. Uh, can, can someone from the chat fill, fill me in on this? What does it do now on counter hit? It doesn't launch, I'm guessing. It knocks down. Do you get a guaranteed follow-up? Oh, it splats them on the ground for a stomp, basically. You get a follow-up. Okay. Um, well, thank God. But you know what? Even with those nerfs, minus four on block and... Uh, only knocks down now, doesn't launch. Still a very good move. Still hits super far away, tracks to one side. I'm, I'm guessing it still forces crouch. I see no, no notes on it. Uh, so honestly, even if it doesn't launch anymore on counter it, it's, it's still a great move. Um, so it, it's just not the best move in the game anymore. Uh, this, this is great. Great, and I'm so happy they responded so quickly to the problems we've had with this character, and especially Evo Japan. Down back one, change the damage from 15 to 12. Good. Crouch status removed. Okay, so it will no longer go under highs and some mids. Uh, so this is great. It will no longer be used as a panic tool you can throw out at any time. Hey, Willem. Uh, and then we have back one during... Yeah, we were all going to head out. Mother-in-law, main man, and Wilhelm. But then the developers drop a patch and I gotta get to work. Uh, let's see, back one dur during counter hit. So that's the 11 frame um, super... You know, um, basically his uh, Feng Wei back one. Change the damage from 30 to 25, so that's 5 damage less. Uh, so it's still going to do around 45 damage, I guess. Uh, back one plus two, another god move. God move. Change the damage from 20... So I, I gotta stress, down one plus two and back one plus two are... It, they are moves from another world. Um, which is so absurd, but we've seen down one plus two take a hefty nerf and now it's back one plus two. Change the damage from 20 to 17, change the frame advantage when guarded from minus five to m minus nine. So it's still safe, but he completely loses his turn, but it still has pushback. Decrease the distance between the character and the opponent when the move is guarded. Okay, so you can no longer do this. So now you'll do it once, and if you don't get a hit or a counter hit, you have forsaken your turn. You will get pressured. Well, that's fair. Um, change the frame advantage upon hit from plus six to plus two. Ooh, increased with recovery animation by 10 frames. That's a very large number. 10 frames. Usually you see like increased with recovery animation by three, four, or five, 10 frames. So it's now going to be. <laughs> I'm donating just in case this makes it into the video so I can brag to my friends. I just made it into the video. Thank you so much for that generous donation. Thank you so much, sir. Very kind. So it's now going to be Oh, they completely... Man, they gave... They schlonged this move. Wow, they punished this move. This move can no longer walk upright. Has to sit down, and it hurts when it sits down. Uh, uh. 
Uh, well, th this is uh, this is great news. Um, this is fair. So again, if you block it now, he completely loses his turn, and if he whiffs it, he's gonna look like an idiot for quite some time. Um, but it is still a twelve frame, fa <laughs> twelve frame fast mid counter hit launcher. That is one frame faster than a standard down forward one. So obviously, it can't be good on block and on whiff, you know. So this is the way the move should have been from the start. And again, even with all of this, it is it is still a great move. You he, he still has crazy frame traps. Down back one free on block, back one plus two. Uh, but th this is more fair, of course. Oh my god, they, they nerf the orbital again? Decreased the range of the attack. Okay, so on the orbital so far, on the previous patch, they made it minus 8 on block instead of minus 3, and now they have decreased the range of the attack. That's great. I mean, it, it never made sense that one of the shortest males in the game had the lo longest range orbital. <laughs> uh, great. Forward, forward, 2-2. Two, two. Decreased the distance between the character and the opponent when the move is guarded. Great. Uh, you used to be able to place it at a very specific tip range where the pushback would make it so that pretty much every... It's minus 13, but pretty much every minus 13 Punisher would whiff. So now, they will be right in your face, I'm guessing, at minus 13, and he's going to eat a punish. So that, that's perfectly fair. It was, it was never supposed to have a Heihachi attribute where, you know, Heihachi's fort for 2 will push you back so far that a lot of characters can't punish. Great. Uh, fort for 3, change the frame advantage when guarded from plus 1 frame to minus two frames. Oh, change the frame advantage when guarded from plus one frame to minus two. So that was the, you know, Ford Ford three point blank would be plus one. If they block it from max range, it would be plus six. But now they've reduced it with three frames. So minus two point blank and maybe plus three from far away. Uh, so this is an additional nerf to Ford Ford three. Uh, very good. Homing decreased. Oh, loses homing attack. It is no longer homing. That's a pretty substantial nerf. That was his, you know, long range, better respect me, you know, don't, don't step. Because Ford Ford 2 2, you, you can step that. Um, Ford Ford 3, it's no longer homing. So he's not completely brain completely brain dead anymore from far away. He still has, you know, amazing tools. Ford Ford 1 plus 2, change the, that's his safe mid knockdown move. Change the damage from 28 to 25. Decreased the distance between the character and the opponent when, when the move is guarded. Okay. Uh, is that like minus 10? So is it going to be punishable now due to that? Uh, I'm pretty sure it is safe. Or is it minus 9? Or was it safe only due to pushback? I think it's minus 9. Um, while rising 2, change the damage from 10 to 8. My god, that's the second damage nerf, I think, to, to while rising 2. Uh... Decreased the distance between the character and the opponent when the move is guarded. Again, that's a fair change. While enemy is down, down back two, so that's the ground pound. Change the damage from 15 to 13. So again, a secondary nerf to his max damage wall combo. On the prior patch, you saw the initial hit on that wall combo. Uh, Hermit forward four took a damage nerf uh, from 25 to 21. And now they've nerfed the damage on the first hit of a ground pound, which follows up after that kick. Uh, so, okay, that's good. Once per match, pimp kick. 
they nerfed the pimp cane again. Well, it, it you know, <laughs> it's just unbelievable to be honest that the pimp cane was a 45 damage long range, like knock this range homing class one launcher that was plus eight on block. I mean, even if it was only used once per match, it's like, it's still a rage drive you can do at any time. And one of the best rage drives in the game, basically. If not the best. Yeah, that's the best rage drive. So, so now they've, um, they've changed the third hit's damage from 25 to 15. So the total damage now is 35. Which is still pretty fucking chunky damage. It's just not Kazuya yeah, perfect, you know, down for to counter it perfect electric damage. Um, it's still great. Oh right, it went from plus 8 on block to minus 7. And now we have reduced 10 damage. Again, it, this is all just testament to how batshit crazy initial Leroy was, you know. Or launched Leroy. And time with enemy attack, parry, increased recovery animation by 5 frames. Okay, so even his parry comes down to earth. And he can't just stand there and do parry parry. If he whiffs a parry now, he looks like an idiot for 5 more frames. Uh, so, unless I am mistaken, these are all of the patch notes. So we saw changes to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 attacks, 16 moves. And then of course you can add uh, the patch we got, what, not even two weeks ago where we had a lot of changes. Uh, that one plus two doesn't force crouch. You misread, did I? Uh, changes opponent's behavior when guard dead. Oh, oh, obviously. I thought they meant the frame advantage will become. But no, what they meant is it does not force crouch anymore. And, and it is minus four when guarded. Oh, of oh, so that means you can now step to both sides. Hmm. Oh, that's good. So you're no longer at a disadvantage playing against Leroy from uh, from player one. Um, okay, you know what? Based upon this, this information, I would like to welcome Leroy to the King of Iron Fist Tournament 7. He's now a Tekken character. He's not, you know, up in the clouds looking down upon everyone, having, you know, tools that... We remember from, you know, very old Tekken games where attacks could have, you know, the most obnoxious properties. But uh, now he's, uh, he's a man of flesh and blood. He breathes like the rest of us. Uh, he's a person. He's not Bruce Almighty. He's not Morgan Freeman anymore. He's, uh, he's a human being. Uh, so, yeah, I'm very happy with this. I'm very happy with this. And uh, yeah, he's, he's, still a, he's still a strong character. He's just not, he's just not broken anymore. Um, yeah, I gotta say, I'm, I'm very happy. And uh, it, it didn't, didn't take them too long to remedy the problem when everyone in the community started whining. Um, and this is why you shouldn't listen to people who say on Twitter, Oh, I'm so embarrassed by the FGC community. Stop whining, everyone. Hit the lab. Get good. Adapt. Leroy's not broken. You just suck. Stop whining. Stop whining. You ever see those people? I see them a lot. This is why we whine. So that shit happens and things are fixed. Uh, so... Um, yeah, I'm very, very happy with this, and I can't wait to try Leroy 3.0. And uh, I'll be doing a video once the, uh, yeah, the patch is released uh, on PC. 
But uh, that will have to wait until tomorrow. I'm going to head out with little Wilhelm. Um, but uh, I, I'm so happy with this. And I'm again, I'm so glad they, uh, they listened and they very, very quickly uh, put their asses on the toilet and shit this out. You know, that was quick. <laughs> and they said... When they said mid-February for the emergency Leroy patch, I thought like, okay, mid-February, they mean like February 25th, you know, but they did not. It's the 12th today and uh, yeah, we already have this. So that was, n no one could have expected them to uh, handle this that quickly. And they, they certainly hit the right moves. Uh, down 1 plus 2 and back 1 plus 2 being untouched uh, on the last patch was a joke. Um, but I'm, yeah, I, I can't stress how positive this is and how uh, how happy I am for, for the community. And so thank you for, yeah, Hellsweep is still homing though. Yeah, and back 4 is still a super long range, almost perfect homing attack. That's what, plus 8 on hit, safe on block. Um, wall splats. You know, he's, he still has superb tools. It's just that many, many, many of these bullshit moves have been hit now significantly. I mean, he's still most likely top tier. You know, it's just that he's going to be a normal character, a very strong normal character now uh, by the look, by the looks of this. Uh, he's not going to be a god anymore. Um, so, uh, I'm very happy and I want to thank you all so much for listening to me. Have a great day, uh, everyone.